All right, let's do this. This thing is packed full of collectibles, guys. This is an old storage unit and two Model Ts. <laughs> Wow, this is once in a lifetime, guys. This is such a great buy. We purchased four storage units. So buckle up, guys, because we've got about two months worth of videos for all four storage units. What's going on, guys? Welcome in. We are only 300 people away from a thousand. Um, shh. You're not, you're not queued in yet. Oh. <laughs> Uh, we're only 300 people away from a thousand subscribers here on YouTube. So shout out to you guys. Thank you so much for following. It's been insane. And also, I know that there's been a long layoff since our last video. Uh, rest assured, we've got a lot of videos in the pipeline, including uh, buying a couple more units. So look out for those. We're almost done. We only got two more videos with this storage unit, and then we are completely done. So that being said, we're going to get going with today's unboxing. We only have a few more boxes left. We're going to wrap this bad boy up and we bought a few more units. So look out for new videos and uh, more than likely the new units will be filmed in the storage facilities like we used to do. Uh, it's going to be fun. Can't wait. And also got another exciting, um, another exciting uh, piece of uh, information I'm going to give you guys towards the end of the video, which is going to be really cool. So, all right. So without being, without that being said, we have... I, what's my cue? You're cued in now. Oh, I'm cued in? <laughs> That's a funny story because I was never supposed to talk in any of these videos on his very first one, and I didn't get cued in there either. Yeah, you're, <laughs> you're being cued in. I'm cued in. Uh, we, have to, box. we have today's box, guys, and uh, like, like always, we have not seen what's in these suckers. It's the first time. Shall we peek and not show Wade? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I know it's freaking heavy. I don't know what's in there. Oh! Okay. Where's the beer? It's a, yeah, where is the beer? Oh my gosh, look at this thing. Oh, we look definitely need beer. That is old. <laughs> this is, a, oh, it is a beer. Um, it these does are have all a, beer mugs. Yeah, these are I, all. I recognize a beer mug a mile away, all even right. though I don't use them very often. <laughs> so my let, dad does. let me uh, unwrap. Oh, here's the, another one of those ships. Oh, Remember you had another darn, one of those icons? I sold that. Yeah, you have another one now. Oh, uh, let, let us get all this unwrapped because as you can see. It's a lot of unwrapping. It's a lot of unwrapping. That way we don't waste too much time. Oop, Whoa. Oh, we did not. Are we less one? Let me see. No, we're good. Okay. These things are so thick, it's hard They're to break heavy. them. They're heavy. All right, let us, let us unwrap these. We'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Ooh, a mini one. Yeah, they're, they're, this one is insane. All right, we're back. We got almost all of them unwrapped. We saved the, one of the bigger ones. So look at this one. This one's really, really cool. It's huge, guys. This is about 15 inches, this guy. Maybe, maybe 12 inches. I don't know. But this thing is cool. It's a German mug. And it's heavy. It has kind of a gray colored glass. Yeah. It's uh, weird. Well, it's got a silver. Looks like it has a silver rim on inside it. It's beautiful. That's it's showing on the outside. This is my favorite one out of the box. Uh, oh, it says Australia. It's not German. Wait, did it? Was it made in Australia? Yeah. Well, it's Australia. What's the front say? Is it Australian? That's Australian. Is it? Okay. Yeah, it is Australian. I think we should go to Australia and have a beer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this thing is huge. It's Australian. Okay. There you go. And All after right. that class, I'd stumble out the door. <laughs> Here's a German. Now this one does say German beer mug. Okay. But it's got it's really nice at the top. It kind of goes in. And there's no chips, guys. This is in beautiful condition. It looks like an old expensive one just by the the things on the bottom. Too. Yes. A German beer mug. That's this thing is really cool. This is big too. Give me an idea. You've got his and her. Yeah, uh, they're about, Australian. Go to Germany. I thought this one would be much bigger, but it's about the same size. The handle's bigger on the German one than it is on the Australian. They yeah. must have bigger hands in Germany. Yeah, do you guys have bigger hands? <laughs> is anybody from Australia and German that can settle that? All right, so we have. What do we have here? You tell me. They're awful pretty. From now, the these thing. are German. They're weighted bottoms. Yeah, these are beautiful. I think they're German. And they got the thumb holder on the handles. Yep, that way you can press down while you're drinking your beer. Give you extra, <laughs> yeah. stu you know, sturdiness. Um, <laughs> that is funny how they have that. Is that Lowenbrau beer? Um, Lowenbrau Munich. Lowenbrau no, beer from it's a, Munich. It's really great condition, actually. 
They're pretty. Yeah, these are really pretty. I hope they show up on the camera because they actually, uh, they look more like crystal beer mugs than beer mugs. And then we have one of these. This is from uh, established 1634, so they've been doing it for a while. Who is it? Can um, I see? It? Yeah, you, you can have a shot at that. Polliner. Polliner. Is that German? Yeah, it's German because uh, there's a wife bri a whiff weef briar. I uh, don't. Let's just it, <laughs> a whiff briar. Let's take that away. <laughs> we don't edit. But it is from a German town, and I won't even try to pronounce it. Okay. Anybody in Germany want to clarify? Um, this is this is a nice glass. There's only one of them though. I like that as a vase in a bar. <laughs> yeah, that would look good. All right, I'll let you show them these. That's your favorite. These are horn mugs. Where are they from? I do not know, but they're horn mugs. I've never they're heavy and weighted on the bottom. And they're glass, or I mean, they're glass. They're glass horns. Look and if you look at the handle, it's like it's curled like a cat's tail. Yeah, that's weird, guys. I don't know where I got that from. I've yeah. been watching a country channel. There's two of them here, <laughs> and you get two of them. And yes. I like how they have the little. It feels good when you grip it, you know, with this little extra piece here. It looks like they took glass and just oh. whipped it around. Okay. I think I'll sell these at the beginning of my next auction. Yes. When is your next auction? It is uh, the 5th of April. So make sure you guys subscribe to Grandma Ventures' YouTube channel, and that way you guys don't miss it. All right. These got kind of a weird green tintish to them. You know, all this glass is different. When you put them together, like this stays real clear and yeah. looks crystally. And... Uh, these are clear over here, and then the others have like a different. They, these are green, and yeah. that is beige. They they do look these. There's do different look colors. A so little green. Tint, I wonder if it's from the age of the glass. I wonder if they're uranium. I don't know. It could well, be. I put my I put that black light on everything. Now. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and then we have, they must too though, because we found that black light from the storage units. So they... Oh, this is a ship, but it's a different one than the one I sold in the last auction. This one says Brig. I should okay. sell this one too so that person can have a collection because yes. it's etched. And it tells about the Brig on the back of it. It's a Brig ship glass. It's a vessel ship. Yep. It was a pirate vessel. All right. So what's your favorite? Um, we didn't show these. Oh, oh, we didn't show those, yes. This one is could be in the beginning of the night when you, you can lift a heavy glass. This one's when you've had a few and you no, need you a lighter glass. No, you start with glass. the big one first. <laughs> and then you start... Then you go with the shots. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is thick. That's what I'm saying. Isn't that heavy? This is thick. Look how thick that is. And it, I need to put... It has a green tint to it yeah. also. I need... I will put the uh, light on everything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, all right. So what was your favorite then? I like the horn glasses. Oh yeah, those are those are awesome. I've seen them once before. Those are unique. I love this one. I know you do. With the little bubbles. That one and this other one over here, I, I like too. All right, let me put all this away and we'll move on to the next box. Uh, but if you need beer glasses, we've got you covered. Remember, all our store links are below. We'll try to get some of this stuff online. So if you guys want any of this. What is that random little glass? Oh yeah, there. Oh, this one's hiding over here, yeah. And I can't figure out what it says. Yeah, I, which way I, to read it? I read it one way and it doesn't make sense. Read it the other. I I don't know. It could but be some rum. rum. Yeah, you get hot rum oh. drinks in those. Yeah, interesting. All right, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Bye. No, we're not going. We're not. <laughs> oh, I'll stay. I'll yeah, stay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, next box. Next, next white. Oh my box god! Is a full. There's this is a combination you would not expect. Okay. Whoa. What is that? Ooh, this is black. There's weird stuff in here. Here, I'll oh. take it all out. Oh. Okay. There's weird stuff in here. Ooh, that's <gasps> nice. That's uranium. I'll bet it. I'll bet. I oh. bet you it is uranium. Oh, that's... my ladies are gonna love this. Glass big. And it has a lid. Ooh, those are weird. Okay, start unwrapping. Oh, well, I want. <laughs> Don't that... forget your job. <laughs> Oh, this Sometimes is cool I forget I'm at work, you know. <laughs> uh, oh, look at that! That's beautiful. All right. I'm not sure what that is. It look, it's a little teapot. On the top. Yeah, but oh, it must hold it old tea bags. Yeah. Oh, is that what it is? Yes, and you pull the individual tea bags out. Well, you guys are gonna love that too. And as whoa, and? something new. Yep. Uh, 
Florida. Kind of reminds you of egg beaters over there. Okay, so let me see here, guys. We got some good stuff here. We have some good stuff. I gotta figure out how this thing works too. It's, it's, <laughs> All right, so we have the first item. That is, that is the weirdest one I've ever seen. I've never, yeah, this is this is interesting. Oh, it's got a little, it, it does say uh, Coors USA 6, C-O-O-R-S -C USA 6, right there. Oh, well, it is old and it is ceramic. Coors USA 6. Maybe they use it in the beer making. I don't know. Well, it could be, I guess. I'm, I mean, we don't yeah. know. All right, so that, let us know it. what this thing is. It's in decent oh shape. Oh my gosh! What is that? This is hand painted. It says on. It. Oh wow! It's a candle holder. It's a, yeah. It does say hand painted. Um, not suitable for dishwasher. Made in Italy. Yeah, you don't want to wash off the hand painting. Yeah, it's made in Italy. What is it? Um, oh, it's it goes like this. Holder. Oh, yeah, it is. It's a candle holder. Oh, it goes like that? Yeah, and then you put your candle in there. <clears throat> oh, I, oh it, I thought it went the other way for some reason. No. Uh, I think you're it goes, right. It goes like that. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice. You guys are probably all cheering. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, it is cool, though. Made in Italy. Somebody made that in Italy. Okay, what do we got over here? Oh, my favorite. I already know my favorite. This is my favorite. So I don't need to ask you. Don't uh, ask we me. We do my have favorite. this weird egg thing. With I the don't hole. know what to say about that. You probably uh, put sand and stuff in there. Or you could put one flower. Oh, we missed this. Uh, that's kind of cool. Ooh, this too. is nice. Oh, this is that uh, Francisco made yeah, do in. Do you think that's a syrup? Pour you for breakfast yeah. or syrup or something? I don't know. It's that Francisco made in California pottery. Oh my this is nice. goodness, I love this. Hope I don't drop it. Yeah. It's glass bake. It's old glass. And it's got something on the bottom, but I can't. And it's it's definitely green to it, so I'm wondering I'm, if this is uranium. I bet that lights up. I hope it lights up. And it's got the top to it, too. Yes. This is nice, guys. This is glass bake. For getting my job is this going to go on your auction? Oh, if, yeah, if you don't take it. No. This is really, really cool, guys. Remember, if you want any of this cool glass stuff, we're going to be doing an auction her oh on Grandma Ventures channel. This is better than I thought it was. Is that etched? It's etched all the way around. Oh, it's, it's heavy. Thick. Why is it so heavy? It just didn't feel like that heavy when it's I picked it up. It's thick. Yeah. And here is my second runner-up for favorite coming up. I love, you can feel the flowers on it. I love it when it's kind of like deeper etching. Yeah, you can feel the flowers on that thing. Here's my second favorite. Okay. It's pottery, and it's a tea bag holder. That's what this is. You fill have it you... up with those tea bags, and then pull one out when you want a cup of tea. Have you ever seen anything like no, this? No, I haven't. I have never seen anything like it's this. It's got a little teapot on top, and it's a beautiful color. Look at that, and it, there's no chips on the teapot. Yeah, so you just put in your teapots in there. Yeah. And then you just grab them when you're I ready. Bet, I bet they have a lot more like that back in the day because nowadays people are so modern, you know. Yeah. That would look cute the on some tea somebody's. was special. That one. Okay, show them no. your new collection. Well, first let's show oh, them this. All right. <laughs> let's see if we can get this going. This is, I've never seen a grinder like this before. Okay, it goes oh. there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I got it. I was wondering off camera. I was trying to figure out how I to like do it. The color. Oh my gosh! Yeah, this is cool. I love the color. Um, I, yeah, I've never seen one like this before. Have you? Yeah, but you'd have to put it somewhere where you could use the arm. Yeah, how does that work? Or maybe it, maybe it goes on the wall. Oh, it looks like it hangs up. Does it? I don't know. Nah. I thought, I saw, now I'm thinking it doesn't hang hole, up. I saw a hole back there. <laughs> now I'm thinking <laughs> it doesn't, and it works great. Well, we got to figure out how, you, where you put it to use it. Oh, maybe you put it on the side of. Oh, there we go. That's what you do. You put it on the side like this. It looks like it has little things to make it not move on the bottom. It's yellow. It's got a wood yellow handle. This I wonder is, what that one latch is for. This is wood. This is really really cool, guys. I've never seen one like this, and we've got, believe me, a lot of grinders. <laughs> <sighs> I, I've got so many grinders I gotta put it's online, so funny. and they're so boring to put online too. I'm I love, I like them, yeah. but I sold like one a couple days ago. Um, 
But they're so <laughs> boring to put online for some reason. I'm always afraid we're going to get a box with more mixers. Yeah. <laughs> Those big ones. Yeah. <laughs> All right. What do we got over I here? I love these. Oh, my goodness. These are new. You don't have a lot of these styles out. I have a lot of these, but not like in this quantity. Um, these are old, guys. Look at these. What are these for, oh, anyway? These are mixers. Oh, these yeah. These are something. I don't know. They go these, all different ways. Maybe these are mixer. They this all have. This is a mixer. I know they're from the 30s because of the wood handles. So these are from the 30s. These are almost 100 years old. This says it's a handy gadget on it. A handy oh, wow. gadget. A handy gadget. Look at that one. I like that one. So, can you believe this? It's almost 100 years old, guys. These. But people would love these. Look yeah. at this unusual one. Oh yeah. They would love these to go with their other stuff. This one you can get a little bow. <laughs> and this one a wood handle. A lot of them got wood handles from like the 20s and 30s. Now here's something. Oh, it has. I don't know what that is. <laughs> there's probably like 30 of these suckers here. Oh, there's a random knife. Yeah, careful. It's a <laughs> Dion Lucas knife. A Dion Lucas? I don't know what that sounds special to me. I know. <laughs> Dion Lucas made in Japan. It's got the wood handle to it. But, you know, with some of those collections people are getting, these would look cute because they're different in their little pots, too. Yeah. Yeah, you probably oh, whisk. The counter. You're probably whisking with yeah. this stuff. That's not bad. And this is, is this using bars? There's a lot of those in here. Yeah. See this old one like this? Yeah. Huh. A lot of people buying this stuff because you guys, uh, a lot of people are getting land oh, yeah. and they want to be primitive about it. Well, a lot of people do their kitchen at antiques and these uh, all go in an antique thing. So what's your favorite? Done. <laughs> Done? That one right there? This one, two, okay. three, four, five. Okay, that's how you're rating it. <laughs> what about all these? <laughs> I like them. Yeah. All right, let's put all this stuff away when I, everybody's asking, where do you put it away at? <laughs> well, right now we're putting it away right here. There might be room in the upstairs bathroom. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so we'll be right back. Uh, but this one by far is cool. I'll be putting this one online soon, guys. Okay, hurry. Oh, <laughs> I thought we were done. No. I, I'll <laughs> Just... show them how hard I work. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's cleared off. And of course, we put it over here. This is the staging area, basically, until we figure out what we're going to do. Um, but that being said, we do have another box. This really? is all books back there, by the way, guys. This is all books in those boxes. I like books, but I haven't had a chance to even look at them. Yeah. I've been so busy. All right. <gasps> oh, Ooh, that's gosh. beautiful. Oh, my gosh. Look at that thing. Wow. Is it all wrapped up? Yeah, there. It's all wrapped up, the whole box. Okay. Uh, let let me unwrap all this stuff, and we'll be right back. You? What about my job? You're, that's, you're doing most of it. <laughs> oh. Oh, they're beautiful. You, you're going to love okay. it. Okay. So, <laughs> we have some of the brightest uranium glass that you'll ever see. It glowed a lot. This stuff glows a lot. So, I'm going to give you a sneak peek of how much these glow. But we found two of them. Normally, we only find one. We found two of these. So, don't go anywhere. I'll take a little trip in to the bathroom with the light off. <laughs> And I'll show you how these things and glow. And he'll be by himself. Yeah. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. All right. It's actually really hard to do this <laughs> holding up the black light. But look at those. This is it, guys. They glow crazy. So this is um, this is the two uranium glass. And even the stems are glowing green, guys. They're really cool. Here you go. What do you think? This is awkward, guys. Hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe. <laughs> okay, don't go anywhere. Oh, I guess I could do it like this. You guys can see that. Look at that. Wow. I bet this is the first time you've been in the bathroom with the lights off on YouTube, right? <laughs> All right, there you go. Okay, we have some hand blown dishes over here. Wine glasses. The stems, uh, you can tell they're individually done and hand blown. They're the same color, but one has a slight. Oh, these are Lennox. Are they? Does it say it? Yeah, it says Lennox. Oh, that's even better. Yeah. 
Wow, I never looked on the bottom of any of them. Yeah, these are nice. And they got, the stems on them are tiny. Okay, <clears throat> what do you got over there? I like these. Maybe you can see where they're from. Yes, uh, I don't see anything on the back. I bet these are from France. Yeah, they look like it, don't they? They look like they're from France. They're beautiful. I but love the color. They would look beautiful to have some drinks in these, though. And there's two of them, not one. Yes. <laughs> Yeah. All right. I always like it when there's two. Yeah. But my favorites, okay. believe it or not, are these. I thought these were plastic at first, but no. th these are glass hand painted. Hand painted margarita glasses. Look at these. Two and different look, kinds of flowers. And they're beautiful, guys. I mean, these are gorgeous. Look at that. And they even painted the the insides with the little that is so buds cool. on them. Look at that. These are really cool. So there's two of those. I've never, uh, somebody's an artist and they yeah. thought, oh, I'll just paint my margarita glasses. Then you have some candy dishes, right? Or nuts. Yeah. Candy or nuts or anything, or candles. You can put those floating candles in there too. Yeah, these, ooh, they. They are lead crystal. They shine They're a little bit. They're crystal clear glass, you can tell. And these, oh. these are nice. Yes. And there's four of them. We could fill all four of them up and drink wine out of them. And yeah. They're so big, you wouldn't have to fill them up for a little while. Yeah. These are nice. Okay, and then we have one lone green one here. Yeah. Poor guy. He's by himself. We're going to throw him in with the burgundy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what's your favorite? Well, I'm going to go with the two uh, glow ones. Yeah. I love the uranium glass. Yep. And he tested that other one that we had earlier with the lid, and he that was uranium also. Yeah. Oh yeah. That there's one uranium. There's one at least one uranium. And we haven't there. tested everything else, but believe yeah. me, there isn't going to be one glassware <laughs> from now on not tested. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So there you go, guys. They're pretty all cool. pretty. Pretty cool. All right. We'll be right back. My favorite, by the way, is the glowing uranium. Yeah, too. the little cordial glasses. But um, the lead crystal stuff. Those hand painted glass. That is very nice. Pretty cool stuff. That gets you. I mean, if you guys are artists, you should be doing some of this. Yes. Look how cool that is to paint dishes. Somebody would love that. All right. Let me put all this away right over there and we'll be right back. Okay. Next box. These are really nice boxes, by the way, too. They yeah. stack nice. Uh, somebody messaged me. Um, that company oh. went out of business in the 90s that made those boxes. So they don't make the boxes anymore. Oh, we're gonna love this box. Oh, wow. Is there any broken? Is this broken? No, it's not broken. Okay, good. Okay, this is all wrapped up. Ooh, that's beautiful. We're is there gonna another one? Love our, we're gonna love this. And it was wrapped special. Oh, there's some bells down there. Okay, don't go anywhere, guys. We're gonna unwrap all this and we'll be right back. Oh my gosh. Oh, I have some others of these. Yeah, we finally found some more. Oh, are we? You're going to have to tell me when to say cut. <laughs> cut. All right. I'm so, uh, we have something really cool. We found one of these already, but now we have an additional four of them. And these things are gorgeous, guys. The other ones we have, though, are not pastel frosty colors. Oh, okay. This is. These things are legit. They're pastel frosted outside shiny inside. i bet these things are made in like italy or something too i mean these things are nice look guys. how shiny the inside is and they're they're kind of heavy so you know they're not Flimsy. i mean yeah these things are beautiful i love them I this do is the, them. this is the favorite out of today this is the favorite my favorite glass items i mean look at these things and they're in fantastic shape this would look good in somebody's home they were my favorite. Look at that. Okay, what do you got over there? This is my favorite. Out of all today? Yeah. Oh, not of out of all today. Oh, and they, they sound... I don't know. They sound weird, too. They're, they're really cool, guys. They're beautiful. All right, what do you got? This is just out of this box. These are made in Bavaria, Germany. And I just love these little cups. They're kind of different shaped they are than normal cups. Bavaria... Uh, <laughs> Bavaria, Germany. N number seven. Yeah, and the I just love the pansies on the front. Yeah, these are those really, might not be pansies. These are thin. They look like they're on a ivy type thing. Look how thin this is. Yeah, though. I think are they espresso cups? I think they are because they're so little. Or because who has that little of a glass of tea? And there's only three of them though. I know that's the only problem. 
But that's okay, because one of our guests doesn't drink tea or coffee. <laughs> <laughs> so we have three. Those things are beautiful. Okay. Those are, and they're thin. You can see my fingers through them. They're bone china. Yeah. Then we have this. This this looks like it's gold plated. It is gold plated. It doesn't have any chips. It has no name. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I think it's a real cute little, I don't know, you could use it for anything. Ring holder, makeup anything, brushes, whatever you want. Anything you want. want. Now you have these. Weighted bottoms. There's, there's four of them. And the glass is super clear. Yeah, oh yeah. It's not... You know, in, it's just really clear glass, and they're all, I think they're hand-blown because they're all just, like, going into one piece. They're really, th you, uh, got the really heavy bottoms. You got to be careful when you ship these things. Uh, these are beautiful, though. People love these. They got to have the heavy bottoms, That's a though. nice size set. Yeah, you don't want it to tip over with your drink. All right, what else we got over here? Well, you got some more over there. What else we have? This, this one is... I really wish we found another one of these. That one's going to go with that big green one over there. Yeah, this this thing is just, it's got the real heavy, thick, solid, you can even see yeah. the bubbles. You see the bubbles in the base? Yeah, you can tell it's like art glass, an art glass vase. Yeah, this is this one's cool. I mean drink glass or vase, candy dish, whatever you want to make it out of. And you have a green one? I'm, we could do a his and her. The, the guy can have the delicate green one. And yeah. the woman can have this sturdy pink This one, one. says hand wash only. Ooh. It's still got its original sticker on there. Oh, wow. And then we That's have weird. hand wash only. And then we have these two. These are gorgeous. And look at the stems on them. However, um, there's two of them. And the, but they've got a beautiful stems on there. Look at that. Somebody's going to want this. See those? And they're different sizes, which makes them unique. Yeah, you give the tall person the tall one, the short person the short one, you won't mix up the glasses. <laughs> yeah. So who's the tallest? You get your tall one, and the short person gets the short glass. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's a good uh, good idea. no one wants to drink after other people these days. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You, you play Guess Your Disease nowadays, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> or invent what, a new one. <laughs> what? what do you, that could be a whole game. Uh, that could be a whole game. I want to know who gets to name the new ones yeah. because they're not picking the greatest you, names. You, you get. I can imagine <laughs> a game in the future where you get like this um, cardboard box and it's got like six or seven different diseases. And <laughs> hey, then, we're getting gross here. <laughs> and then you you put them on there and then you pass it around and you say, "Guess your disease." No, I'm joking. It's it's been it's been crazy though. That went uh, further than I thought it would. <laughs> we, we will not pass a disease to you if you do visit. Yeah, yeah. Or if you buy any of these. But if not. we do, you get to name it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So there you go, guys. There's another. I We found some of these already. Yes. Um, we found some of these already. And I think I still have them somewhere. I'm going to. I'm looking around first. Okay. What's your favorite? In this group. The German. I just like the German uh, bone china little yeah. cups. I love the frosted though. I love that too, but yeah. for some reason I'm drawn to those. Okay, let me put all these over here, over there, and we'll be right back. We got a theme going. Yeah, it's, it's, <laughs> I'm, and we're not peri, uh, cherry picking these boxes. I wonder it's how random. many more boxes of we're, and what we're going to find. <laughs> all right, it's next box. I'm hoping for your uranium ware. <laughs> <laughs> it's uranium glass. Okay, what's in there? You tell me Let what me kind see. of brush you want, and I'll tell you what one we got. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> These are old 1946. brushes. 1946. 1946 brush? Yes. Wow. And it has it carved in wood here and a name. Okay. Wow. That is... Oh, it does have a carved in wood? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. You know, people collect these old brushes. Well, they're kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, people collect these old suckers. Oh, this is really old. I wonder if they could be used for paint brushes. Looks like we got a couple paint brushes in here. There's all different kinds of brushes here. And uh yeah, let's check them out. Okay. Okay, this does say 1947 on here. Oh, 40, why does it say 40 46 on the other? Oh, it thing? does say 1946. Sorry. <laughs> it does say uh, it does say 1946. Are they screwed up on their dates? <laughs> This is old. You know, this is 80 years old. Crazy. Oh, it's got, um, oh, it's still in really good shape, actually. It's solid. Huh. 
There That's you go. Weird, isn't it? I wonder what they used it for. All right, we have that brush. We have this one. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh, look at the old um, nails in here. Looks like they bought it for five bucks back in the day. It's got um, a wood handle, but old nails. Wow, this is thick too. Look at that. We've got a whole collection of them. I'm trying to put this set together. It says it's a 10 piece set. And then we have Pure Horsehair Shoe Brush. Made in the United States. It says Pure Horsehair Shoe Brush. So this is horsehair. Kind of looks like horsehair, huh? Yeah, that's kind of, you know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, we have this brand. It seems uh, the longer lasting shine. So this is probably a, an old shoe. Probably horsehair too, maybe. Okay. They did a lot of horsehair. Back then. Ooh, ooh. What is that? Oh, I, I, I hope it's Vaseline. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Are you going to wash, it's all wash your hands stuff. after the yeah. box? Well, I'm going to have to leave for a minute. I'll no. <laughs> There's no commercial breaks. No. Okay. Wade, can I touch you with this stuff? No, no, you keep that over there. <laughs> um, we have this really old one. I wonder if this is bake, a bake light handle. Um, Main Taiwan. This is a four inch brush, guys. I see how neatly I'm putting it over here so you guys can take a look at it. Okay. You're so professional, yeah. I have to tell. Oh, oh, almost lost the camera. Okay, here's another one. This is um shoe polish, horsehair. And here this horse must have been beautiful. <laughs> look at that hair. Okay. So we got two of those. We have another old brush here, so that's three. <laughs> Are you holding your thumb up? Well, I don't want to get it all over. <laughs> and in my mind, it's Vaseline that hasn't been used. This is Royal Sweden, made in Sweden. Oh, I like that one. That's a special one. Yeah, can hang look up at that. Too. Look at that. The so wood's so shiny. Shiny wood on that one. Then we have this one here is made in the United States, Fuller. It's a fuller brush with a wood handle made in the United States. It's got bristle on it, actually. Fuller brush oh, used that, to go... That, that kind of hurt. Ooh. Yeah. Is that like an iron uh, or a... Yeah, this is, um, this is not hair. That kind of... Yeah, this is the rough... Fuller brush used to go door to door. I knew, I remember when they came to see it, it. It's that type of hair, that, that metal. Yeah. Ugh. It got me in the finger there. Okay, we're both injured from this one. Okay. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have a toilet brush. Made in the United States. Is that a toilet? That, that, that might not be a toilet. <laughs> I don't think it is. I'm just joking. Could be though. Um, we got some really... Oh, these are made in Ireland. These brushes are made in Ireland. <laughs> Look at that. Um, these are made in Ireland. That's that weird. That is cool. You yeah. Know, I wonder if an artist would appreciate uh, vintage brushes. Yeah, these are old brushes. Like made in Ireland. Wow. Kind of shocking. Okay, we got... This guy here. Oh, this looks like the other one. Well, this is probably leather. Now that I think that about it, that is leather around the top. So it's got old. It's hammered in with nails. That's. This, it looks usable. It looks like horsehair, though, don't it? Yeah, it looks. It's definitely usable. Man. Okay. Oh, oh, almost lost him again. Okay, sorry guys. Um, here's another one. We got a lot of brushes in here. Here's another. That's a toilet one. Small one. I'm joking. Okay, what do we got over here? Okay, we got these two things. This, I want you to show them. It's okay. ceramic. Okay, I'm obviously doing the top of this one. Oh, <laughs> by the way, this has the same brand as the other one. That that big white one right there that says Coors. Remember, yeah. we were like wondering what it was. Then they should go together. Yeah, these go together. That it's the same brand as this one right here. That's an old glass, old ceramic. Yeah. Um, so this one here. That's weird. That must be a very older brand of ceramic. So you can see here. This is the. Um, we gotta look it up. This says Coors USA six on here. That's what that says. And this one here says Coors USA J. Oh yeah, there you got you got some Vaseline or something. That, that does look like Vaseline, don't it? <laughs> Please tell me yes. Don't do that. <laughs> don't I don't want old gook on me. <laughs> I can't believe it's still sticky after all these years. <laughs> I'm hoping that's what it is. Oh, okay. Okay. This, Next. This is a ten piece set, but I don't know if there's ten pieces here. That's one, the two, ivory three, set three, or whatever. I know they're in here. There is something. Yeah. yeah. Well, that this is just the brush. I found two. No, there's of something in there. Oh, is there? Oh, Fingernail yeah. Fingernail file yeah. things, and then you got these others in the brush. 
You got two trays, and this little thing here goes with it. But I thought this might, but it don't match. Don't These know. don't match. So. Yeah. This is and a, then this is something that goes in that. This is an old, like, um, you know. A uh, grooming kit. Yeah, with a brush. Look at all these old brushes, though. If you guys want any of these, let me know. Did you put Vaseline on your no, face? No, it's over here. <laughs> okay. I'm going to go wash it. <laughs> Look at these old brushes. So if anybody wants these 1940s brushes, let me know. Oh, and then we also have... What are these? Is this one of the first well, these shavers? these shavers, but see, the, that one has a cover. Yeah, this one's nice. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's a nice old shaver. I bet that's yeah. his and this is hers. Yeah, oh, and then look at this one with the design on there. Oh, it looks like it's hand-painted. That looks like a hair trimmer. Yeah, I've never seen one this small before. I don't think that's a shave. I don't know. I don't yeah. know. I don't okay. know. <laughs> After the Vaseline, <laughs> you're brave. I don't know. You need to go wash your hands. Okay, all right, let's take a look at this. We have three more items here. Man, even back then, it wasn't just kitchen stuff. It was anything was could be deadly. Yeah, look, this is a sharpener of some kind. These are made in the United States. It, it, anything back then could be deadly wherever you're at. This must be for your nails. Nowadays, you can't do this because uh, it's, you know, lawsuits and everything else. You could get pricked or pinned or something with this. It's got to have a bunch of warning labels on there, right? <laughs> I All would, right. I wouldn't sell anything without a bunch of warning. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that's this box. There you go. All right. I will be back. You're going to go wash your hands? You're going to wash my hands. Okay. <laughs> uh, put in the comments what you think was in that little container. Do you think it was Vaseline or not? Let us know. It was Vaseline. <laughs> it was unused Vaseline. <laughs> All right. Sneak peek. Sneak peek. Uh, this one's not closed. But it's a lot of wrapping. But it's all unwrap or it's all un. So let's go ahead. Let me get. Um, actually, we can um, start unwrapping. I'll take it out. We don't all need right. to take a commercial break for this one. All right. Ooh, this one's got some unique good. stuff in here. This is a random box, guys. Ooh, what's that? It's got random all over it. Oh, that's a card that file. Stuff. Yeah. Okay. What do you got over there? I don't know. I'm really uh, kind of excited to see what it is. I like the design. Oh, it's wow! It's very cool. Oh, we got a big... oh. oh no! I thought we I thought we got a second one of those, but uh, we don't. This has a name on it. Yeah, I bet that's a waffle maker. Oh gosh, that's, that'd be the heaviest. I recognize maker. those. Okay, that's the heaviest waffle maker ever. <laughs> Thing is heavy. <laughs> All right, so we have a blue ribbon beer mug. This thing is old. Probably one of the first they ever made. You would think. Man, oh. it's got a little. This thing is in beautiful shape, though. Did anybody drink Blue Ribbon? Let me know in the comments. Mom and Dad. Ooh, is this too. hand? It, it's really pretty. It, oh, it's got that weird brand. K-E-M-I-N-G-H-T-N. I need to look it up. I can't remember. I-K on it. Um, it's got that weird brand to it. This is nice. Oh, wow. It's I a love beautiful it. It shape. It's strong. It's in beautiful shape. Look at that. It's sure cute. Handles on the sucker. I like the uh, design, the wheat. I think it's made out of aluminum. It is. Yeah. Oh, that's that's a really unique piece. It's a thick aluminum, too. Yeah. You don't see it like that anymore. All right, we have some more Vaseline over here. No, it isn't. It is a perfume bottle, probably. Oh, my gosh. What do you got? I don't know yet. I'm, I'm building it. I'm unwrapping it. <laughs> And then I'll put it together for you. Maybe that's uranium. Glass. I think it's going to be pretty neat to tell you the truth. We have a Miller High Life Old Glass. Pilsner. It's uh, faded just a tad bit there. It's a Pilsner glass. Okay. Yes. And you have? I'm not sure. But I have four of them. And they all have lids. Oh my gosh, that's a cute set. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Look at that. 
This is a really cute set. Look at this. What are they for, though? Um, I don't know. And they're in great shape. And they're loom. Are they? They're really light. They're like extremely Do you light. You think they're loom? I think these are for camping. These are old camping, probably from the 50s or 60s. I think they use these for camping because the. They're like super light. They're like maybe two ounces, three ounces. That's it. They're really light. You could actually use them for anything. You can use them for anything, yeah. But I think these, and they're well, beautiful. Well, why couldn't you put those on the table with different taco things like tomatoes, onions? I Why is it always good to tacos with you? It's one of my favorites. <laughs> it's always about tacos. Wade makes the best tacos no. you ever. Yes, you do. All right. So this is, um, this these are really cool. This is my favorite thing so far we found in today's video. These are really cool, and they're light. All right, next we have... Wade's actually a great cook, that's all I'm going to say. We have another German <laughs> mug. This one's in beautiful shape, actually. Look at the design on that. They didn't wash it. You're not supposed to wash these. All right, hand wash them. We have an Irish cream liqueur. Ooh. Does that sound good? It does sound good to me. <laughs> oh, Brendan's. Here, Brendan's I, Superior. Ooh, this is an old Bailey's. St. Brendan's. I know I like that. That's really cool. Okay. What do we got in here? Ooh, some tools. Random. Or some random stuff. Okay, random. You can put that random stuff with that random stuff. Screws. We show you everything, guys. Screws. Okay, we don't need to show those. We got those a are... lot of screws going on here. Yeah. Now, these are cool. Some of these can be quite pricey. Sold one on the auction. I was shocked when I pulled up the price live. Went for like $75, just one pack. Uh, these are brand new sealed. This means something to somebody. Yeah. Oh, it's heavy. It's thick. Michigan. I think he, he went to Michigan. That's why. Okay, what do we got over there? Oh, it's got the cord and got the, everything. Really, the cord, but... It's Look, it's heavy. Been used and it's oh nice. Oh my gosh! Let's make the best waffle. This thing is. Th this has got to be eight pounds. That's a permanent counter fixture. Yeah, this is. You eight. get it out once, you're just gonna leave it on the counter and <laughs> you don't want to get it out again. This sucker is heavy, <laughs> but it's beautiful. Somebody will want it. Yeah. Okay. All right. We have some buttons. Oh, old buttons. People ask for that. Yeah, we have old buttons. Yep. This is a desk. You put it on your desk and it's got all the... I used to have one similar yeah. years ago. You put it on your desk there and it's metal. And I work for an insurance company. We have a birdcage. <laughs> I don't know if that's what it is. I'm just guessing. I think a light bulb cage. Yeah, you're right. Actually, you're right. Yeah, because you take this off and you put the light bulb in there. This is an old light bulb cage. All right. And what is up with this mess here? Are all these I screws? You. <laughs> are all these screws and stuff? I think they are. Oh, whoa. What are these those? are cool. Um, well, you got a couple things here. You want me to open it or? Oh, I can. It's a zip tie. See, look at that. Oh, it's old the, rollers. Yeah, but these are the wood. They got the wood. Um, oh, wow. I've never seen wood. I've never seen wood before. There's a whole set of them. Oh, those are neat. They've, Those are neat. They've got wood um, wheels to them. Look, is there another one? Let's see, got three. I hope there's four. Oh yeah, there is. There's four right there. And that must be some part that goes and with And you see those milk glass yeah. looking uh, drawers? Knobs. Knobs, yeah. Oh, those are so pretty on cabinets. Yeah. So, all right, let me put all this away. What's your favorite item? Does it take that long? <laughs> the taco bowls. Okay. The, the, the <laughs> camping stuff. All right. I'm assuming they're camping because they're light, but maybe they could be taco they, bowls. They could be anything that you want to put something yeah. in and cover it up. All right. Let me put all this away. We'll be right back. Okay. Two small boxes. Two very small boxes. Huh. Ought to be interesting. I don't Is know if it? I. Oh, I need this. <laughs> oh, a percolator. I need it to go in one of the silver. Whoa. Yeah, that goes in the. Oh, that's glass. That'd go be nice in that one of those. Well, silver... some of some of them um, they're unique because they got the bases that are different sizes. I'll have to see if it'll work in yeah. where what I need it for. I don't drink coffee, but whoa, that don't. That's work. glass. Ooh, there's an old exit sign. I love that. And you put it up on a light. That's a really old exit sign. 
Look at that, guys. That this, is cool. This is an old glass red exit sign. I'm trying to think where we could put that. I don't know. Outside, on our outside light. See, it holds up top. Look at that. That is really cool. Ooh, old Gibson. And you have your percolator here. This is yeah. glass. I've never seen a glass I'm, one. I'm hoping it works in that coffee pot, yeah. but I obviously I did it wrong. It's not yeah. working, you know, too good. But. <laughs> old percolator. And then we have some rubbing alcohol. 70% glass bottle. It's a beautiful shape with the original cap. Oh, you know that stuff, milk and magnesia? Yeah. This says it's something of magnesia. And it has a glass lid. Oh, wow. When, yeah, milk so, them. Yeah. I don't say milk. It calls it a concentrate or something. And it's got the original top to it. Yeah. Huh, concentrate. How things used to come like that. Ugh, I would not. <laughs> Nowadays, I would not. Okay, anyway, another one. <laughs> Look at this. This is a coffee. Drip grind. Yeah, it's. I don't know where the lid is, but it looks like one of those basic tops. It's got an old matchbook in there. I wonder yeah. if there's some gold in that little matchbook. Maybe Could be. that's how we hide it. You never know. People, yeah. a lot of people hide stuff in the bathroom. Anything in it? No. No gold. All right. All right. Next. Oh, we got another one. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh my God. Get the pellet gun out. Do we got another? Uh, get the shotgun. And we'll shoot these over the neighbor's backyard so we don't have to pick it up. Yeah. No. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm teasing, of course. Ah, uh, we love our neighbors. I never do anything. The neighbors don't even know me. Yeah. <laughs> they never see me. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we have... They did get um, pissed off one time, though. Why? We're talking about those neighbors over there, guys. But why? We, we love them. Why? Because um, uh, remember when we had the trampoline out here? Oh, yeah. Well, I got Cade a whistle, and he was whistling while he was jumping on the trampoline. Oh, that would have drove me nuts, too. <laughs> Why would you get your own child uh, to whistle? That's something your brother gets yeah, your child. Yeah, and you I, know, to I told him until 10, you can whistle as much as he wants. So that was that was a fun time. All right, what do we got? Oh, I think 8 o'clock should have been the cutoff. <laughs> but this was like noon. This was like lunchtime. And he's playing around out there, you know? And it's a... Look at how far away their house is. It's like way back whistles there. Whistles are annoying. Yeah. yeah well, I you agree. You don't get but... your own kid whistle. <laughs> <laughs> but it's outdoor activity with a trampoline. Well. So he was. He, the, until... he seemed to sing. That would have been better than blowing a whistle. No, I, I, I don't. <laughs> I really don't think that's the case. All right. So here we go. <laughs> uh, these are clay pigeons. And have these... you tried selling any of these yet? Because you've no. had others. Well, they use them for other um What else do you to, use them for? Well, people can use them for arts and crafts. I mean, anything they want to yeah, make out of Yeah, you want to repaint them. This yeah. orange color is like the whistle. It's bad. <laughs> yeah, they, they can they can use whatever they want. But oh. um, So if you want to annoy your neighbors, get your kids a whistle and have them whistle while they jump on a trampoline. It might annoy your, their grandmother, too. So. <laughs> All right. I didn't hear it. I didn't. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, well, I'm glad I wasn't here. <laughs> I'm teasing. Okay, guys, let me put this away. We'll be right back to the last box. All right, next box. Next box. We Can have. Go ahead. It's all wrapped up. Oh my gosh, big bowls. What's that say? Oh my gosh, big that up, Wade. Yeah, they're they're all. I've never seen one that heavy. Well, it's just stuck. Oh. <laughs> yeah. They're all, um, we're not going to unwrap these These guys. are Hamilton, Hamilton Beach. Yeah, these are old, and a lot of these are um, actually Pyrex. Did, and they're sets. Pyrex did a deal with Hamilton Beach, so they're actually Pyrex, yeah. Hamilton Beach. Oh, they holes. have the lines that so everybody can, likes. This one, and that one has the lines. You get good at these bowls when this you have 50 knows. million of them. But yeah, these are the, the old, old Pyrex right there, you see. Pyrex Hamilton Beach. This would be a good way to bowls. ship those. Yeah, they actually they would. All wrapped up like this. I may actually throw these like this. We'll put them on the auction, guys. So if you want some of these really old, beautiful yeah. white bowls, they're about twelve inches. These things are big. And he don't have to wrap them. They're wrapped for shipping. Yeah. They're yeah. solidly wrapped. They're ready to go. <laughs> Maybe I'll unwrap one just Two to show you. Two of them you. have lines and one don't. Yeah, that I didn't think I had any more of these. Because... And they have spouts on the little ones. Yeah. Little poor spouts. There you go. There's some Pyrex bowls. These are beautiful, and some of these got the spouts on them. The, the small ones do. Do you have any unwrapped right now? I don't. I don't oh. have any more of them. Oh, I was gonna say it'd be 
good I, to show one and then yeah. okay I, here's yours <laughs> i sold all these on the auction already they're um, hard to uh ship yeah they're not cheap either these old ones so all right let me get let's, love see, these. let's do one more box all right um surprise me just to uh let's do this one here oh this smells nice i do see santa claus but he smells nice yeah, the whole box smells really good. And he has, he, you can put a light in there. Santa Claus normally smells nice though. Well, I would think so. These are old, this is an old Santa. Christmas is going to be here before you know really it. I really these are old ornaments. Oh, it's, it's, oh, wow. Yeah, they don't make this anymore. No, it's. Look at that face. Oh yeah, you put a light, you can put any light you want in there. This is probably from the 70s. He's about 15 inches. Oh, wait, that looks cool. Oh, wow, this is nice, too. I have too. a feeling there's old ornaments in these boxes. They feel like something's in there, but they feel light. Okay. I that's... love this. That's what smells nice. I like the eucalyptus. It has the green and the burgundy eucalyptus. Yes. This. They, oh, this is um, all... They've got dried flowers in here. That's what yeah, makes it smell nice. The eucalyptus flowers. Wow, it smells really Ooh, nice. Ooh, that's beautiful. Yeah, do you smell it? Yeah, that's nice. And then we and have... It, and it feels moist. It's not too dry. This is brand new. We have a Santa bag oh, here. my job done. Oh, there's something in here. There's things in there, but it's so light, I think they're vintage candles. I mean, uh, ornaments. Oh, there's a hamburger. A hamburger? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't yeah. think that. <laughs> but there is also... A really old Santa. Oh, isn't he cute? Is he wood? It or? says Midwest, made in Cannon Falls. And look at that. Oh, it's a Dr. Santa. Oh, somebody will and, want and he, that for their... And he's got his uh, stethoscope thingy, in, or whatever they call that, on the bear. Oh, how cute is that? Oh, yeah, look at that. I'm feeling we're going to find some good ornaments. Maybe they had the... They probably had the... We'll have to let Ashley look at them before we... Hamburger in there to like keep it safe. Okay, here's another one. Oh, wow. Well, they must have loved hamburgers. Look at this. This is a glass Christopher Ratko. Oh wow! This they they make really expensive ornaments. It's that Christopher Ratko. Have you? I, I know. Oh, wow. I know for a fact because um, these things are really expensive. Um, Jason sold a bunch of them. Oh wow! I wonder um, if all these are. These are. This is this is about four inches. This is a big. This is a Christopher Ratko. That's hamburger. definitely four inches. Wow! That In is perfect shape. Here, I'll put it shape. away for you. That is that is really cool. I wasn't expecting that at all. I think all of these are ornaments. Okay, let's and then see we'll show this last this for a reason. Here. Oh, look at that. Oh, that reminds me of that they one unit. They got their tags. Isn't that cute? It reminds me of the, the crafting sheep. unit, yeah. Look at this. We sold those sheep. This, I love that one. Yep. This this is an old piece. This is from look the 90s. Look at the shoes. Oh, this is 2001, so this is 20 years old. Is that old. a Kris Kringle? I don't know. Kringle one? Okay, you want to put him back? Yes, I'll put him back for you. There's that. And then we have a Avon gift collection. Let's see this. Oh, this is a... Okay, this is not Avon. This is made in France. Um, Brandy of Napoleon. Huh. Is there another one in there? Let's I gotta see. figure out how to put this back. This is tricky. Yeah, don't break his leg. I won't break his. I don't want to break oh, we his have, feet. We have two of them. This is brandy. Uh, the brandy of Napoleon. Oh, good. There's two. Made in France. They have to be special. Yeah, there's a tiny. You okay, can see there. The, where does this go? Right yeah, it's, here. It's this. Tiny. Those suckers are. What did he go in? Right here. Avon. All right. Oh no. Uh, I don't know. We'll figure it out after. I bet it's this one. Okay, we got yeah, another. Do we have another Ratco here? Is it? Is it? No, it's not Ratko. It's but it's something. definitely it's from the 70s. Wow, it's pretty. Yeah, oh wow. This is yeah, oh this is made in Germany. Made in Germany, yeah, guys. These are special. Look at that. This is a made in Germany. This is the original box. And there's no cracks, nothing on there. Wow. People pay big money for this old glass. Put that in the way. Okay, now. Uh, some of these boxes don't show the same thing on here, so they just they were special. You have to be really careful. 
Because they're all glass. Okay, this one is. This one's not glass. That I, one it, almost looks handmade. It is. Yeah, this is definitely handmade. Just like a handmade bulb, maybe. Pretty cool. Not as cool as the Germany one, though. And what's in the gap? The little gap box. It has to be an ornament. Okay. Or nothing? There was something in here. Yeah, there's nothing in here. You sure? Yeah, positive. Well, I hope there's something in this one. There's nothing in that one. And then we got to figure out this one. That's there, a, that's a. Uh, there's something to figure out. Okay, let's see. Oh wow, there was something in here, but there's nothing in these. Okay, I don't know. I or unless pull... unless Ashley snagged some of the Christmas. Do you think she cheated? And looked <laughs> in the see, it opens. And then there's stuff stuffed in there. Is this the toilet bowl thing? No. <laughs> oh, I get it now. Let me see. Oh, wow. It's... A jack in a triangle? Yeah. <laughs> I've never seen... Oh, oh that, he goes oh. up and in. Yeah, okay, you figured it out. Yeah. That's, it. That's on the bottom, not the top. Is this handmade? No, this is not. This this isn't handmade. Where do they but make this? But it uh... is cool, isn't it? Yeah, it's just the Mark Roberts collection. I bet we need to look that up. Yeah, the, we need to look this up. It's got a tag right here, too. Oh, yeah. This is the Mark Roberts collection. It's got the tag right there. This thing is... And you can turn it, too. Look at that. He entertains. Hit the thumbs up button. Yeah, and he's got... Is that porcelain? Let maybe? me see. Porcelain head, maybe? Porcelain. Yeah. Look at that. I... W oh... <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty cool. That I couldn't figure it out, and I didn't want to pull it out for the first time without you guys seeing it. Yeah, that's really, really cool. Yeah, he has a porcelain face. Come on now, get <laughs> get in there. We can he, he's in. been in there for years. Yeah, he got out, and he, he doesn't want to <laughs> yeah. go back. All right, that's today's video. Hit the thumbs up button, guys. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. 300 people away from 100,000. Yes. That is so close. I didn't know you were that close. I will be doing a giveaway. So that you guys uh, share with your friends. 300 people away. I'll start calling everybody I yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, that's today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I think we have only one more from this unit. Can you believe it? That's going to be sad, but you know what? It just uh, makes us go on to other things. Uh, another another yeah, adventure. I'm ready. Our store links are below, guys. So if you want anything, um, if you want any of this stuff, we're going to be trying to put them online. Both of our store links are below. Just click it, and uh, yeah, you're good to go. Or in the auctions. All right, guys. That being said, have an amazing day. That's obviously my favorite piece of the whole video. Uh, this is mine. Video. This is, oh, I don't know. Let's see. That's mine. <laughs> I like that sheep. Yeah, the sheep is pretty cool. All right, guys. See you tomorrow. Have an amazing day. And those go in here. I can't wait for new adventures, but I do. This is a bittersweet. All right, guys. See ya. What's good is there's always more. There's always more. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs>